The following fight is a PFL Europe regular season contest in the lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. He's a kickboxing specialist and stands 5 feet 11 inches tall. He weighed officially at 156 pounds and holds a perfect professional record of eight victories and no defeats. Fighting out of Austin, Poland, the auditor, Jakub Kaszuba. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He is a wrestling and BJJ specialist and stands five feet seven inches tall. He weighed in officially at 155 pounds in 12 professional contests, has earned a record of 10 wins and two losses. Fighting out of Turin, Italy, Radu Maxim! <laughs> Your referee in charge, Mitch Mitchell. Rich Mitchell will oversee the action. Radu Maxim in the green, Jakub Kashuba in the gray. Both guys are ready to go. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's go. Both very good wrestlers, but a very different striking style. Kashuba a lot more technical. Maxim's got big power, but beautiful takedown right from the start for Kazuba. Jakub Kashuba, he, he flicked the left high kick out there and then he changed levels, but look at Maxime right back to his feet. Yeah, beautiful job using the underhook, get back to his knees. But Kazuba again, who's pressing the action, looking for the takedown. As I said, there's a real intensity about Radu Maxim, and you could see. Oh! oh beautiful! What? Oh, wow! Are you kidding me? It's over! <laughs> oh, wow! Sacrifice throw there for Radu Maxim, taking risks early. Radu Maxim Airlines. Man, beautiful. He's so dangerous with the body lock. Now he's on a single leg. You can see him drawing that leg in. Kasuba's trying to sprawl out here. Steps over the back foot. Beautiful way to catch the leg. Maxim changes direction, draws Kasuba back over his own left leg. See if he can get to the back. Good job from Kasuba on the defense here. Just over a minute gone in this fight, and there's already been wow. a lot, a lot of energy expended from both of these fighters. I feel like Maxim's going to pull out something else here. He's, he's, he's using that uh, shin as a guard across the leg of Kasuba right now, but that doesn't mean he can't turn it into a takedown. And Kasuba now knows that there's not a single second he can lose focus in the clinch. So Maxim's going to make the most of that. Radu Maxim keeps letting his right arm and now his left come up over on that overhook position. A, a lot of times that's a, a surrender from people, but not from Radu Maxim. He's using that overhook to try and set up throws. This time, Kashuba is setting something up, but Katsuba used it against him. Now he's in a very dominant position with Maxim against the fence. Lay it on, watch, watch your left arm. I expect Maxim to use the fence in a moment to scramble back to his feet, but for Kasuba in this position is going to be really difficult to budge. Good job by Maxim holding Kasuba close to him. Kasuba can't really explode this way. Kasuba is a lot bigger, man. I wonder how much he weighs right now. He's a big, big lightweight. Not a comfortable position here for Maxim with his head crammed up against the fence like that. And oh, now, no. no. wow. Jakob Kashuba. Sky wide from the back of his head there, Jakob. Flattening Radu Maxim out. I think Kasuba is trying to move him away from the fence. See if Maxim wants to use it. Oh. We're in a good position here for Kasuba. Oh, oh, Body lock. Position. Body triangle for Kasuba. He's flattening Maxim out with it. That hurts. That was a thudding short punch from the side, and now he says, Get Radu Maxim behind the head. Grimacing and in trouble here. Ron Switches Ron to the short choke. And he's got three it. Fights, three finishes. Yaku Kasuba stays undefeated. At three minutes and 18 seconds of round number one, 
Declaring your winner via submission to a rear naked choke and securing their place in the PFL Europe playoffs, Jakub Kashuba! Jakub Kashuba. First of all, still undefeated as a pro mixed martial artist and one step closer to a PFL European Championship. I imagine that's what you expected here tonight. You smell that? That's the 100,000 inflated dollars being issued by the Federal Reserve. That's waiting for me. So Biden, don't spend too much. I want to have some worth of money. Uh, let's talk about how this fight played out. Uh, you know, strong start from you. You flick the high kick, then you change levels for the takedown. He gets back to his feet. He hits you with the big toss. You're able to end up getting onto his back. Did you know that the rear naked was sunken? You were going to finish it. I heard him breathing. Like, like a cow about to be slaughtered. He was, <gasps> I'm like, oh, I'm thinking that, uh, you know, triangle and body triangle, and I'm going for it. He flipped me almost, but I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna be tight. He's tired. I'm gonna finish this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you, you switched the grip, right? You had the head behind the neck and then you switched to the short jump. Yeah, yeah, short is just, I've been training that, but that's, that always comes back to me. But at least he reacted and then I switched it and, and got it tighter, so. It turned out well. Now you go backstage and, and you watch closely to see who you're going to be fighting in Paris. Yeah, I'm excited to watch the Anglo-Saxon, the Celt go at it. It's going to be a fun match. <laughs> I'm really excited. And I want to thank my sponsors, uh, Microchips USA. They're opening here in Germany. And uh, Piotr Zihovic, Historia Realna, Historia Shijin, Novasi Kochak. Jakob Kishuba still undefeated and moving on to Paris. Congratulations.